So if you have any questions from staff that are standing by to assist, thanks for spending time to someone who's been making cooking easier and smarter than ever through innovative technology and state-of-the-art design for people all around the world. Now, I admit that I am definitely not a chef. So we actually have a chef from the FGM restaurant group here to share his perspective with us. Chef Francisco Guzman, everyone. Hi, please. Hi, everyone. How are you? Hey, Chef. Thanks for coming. So I know that you cook an awful lot in the kitchen at work, obviously, but what's important to you when you're cooking at home? Uh, I can tell you, basically, cooking is not only my job. Cooking is one of my biggest passions. Some people, a lot of people are surprised how much time I spend cooking at home with family and friends. Okay, if you can design your ideal kitchen? Uh, it's all about making things easy and convenient. Okay, you've taken a look at our kitchen. What do you think? The design is spectacular, but I still, my first thought is, what is the appliances? Uh, the appliances, yeah, let's talk about that. So, you guys can actually join us here on the stage. You can come in, fill in along the sides here. If you like, you can come in along here. We'll be right here in our main prep area. Um, so, if you could put anything right here, what would you like? I want my ingredients as fast as possible. Probably the refrigerator and give me an easy access. All right, so that is exactly what you have here. You have a refrigerator drawer. Wow. So that you can grab your fresh ingredients and you don't have to take more than a step or two. But what if you're out grocery shopping and just can't quite remember what it is you're low on? Well, there's an internal camera inside the fridge which you can access via smartphone or tablet at any time. So if you're at the grocery store, you'll always know exactly what you have to bring home because you can see the inside of your fridge. Oh, yeah. I love these features. Come inside the fridge and give me remotely access to anywhere. It's fantastic. That's pretty great. Go ahead and press on that panel right there for me. That is our dishwasher. There we go. And likewise, it also has a built-in camera so that you can check on the progress of your wash cycle if you need to. Sir, I'm gonna go right there. This is a new concept for ovens. This is an oven that actually uses three different types of heat to get the job done. Intense oven heat and microwave and steam. What do you think about that? Have these three options in one device? It's fantastic. Yeah, and of course, it also has an interior camera so that you can go ahead and check on the progress of your food if you need to remotely. Wow, be able to see what's happening inside while keeping the temperature of the system is a really great feature. <laughs> it is pretty great. All right, so this is a freestyle induction oven. Now, induction is a technology that's been used for cooking in Europe for quite some time, and it's just beginning to make inroads here in the U.S. What makes this induction oven really unique is it automatically recognizes the size and shape and position of whatever cookware you choose to place on the surface. Sensors beneath the surface will collect information and then very efficiently heat the contents of the pot. Now, those of you over here, some of you over there, you might, rec might be able to see that there's a little screen at the bottom of our hub here. That is our control center. And I'm gonna use that to demonstrate our next very interesting feature. We have weight management or weight wow. measurement sensors underneath the, set, uh, the surface as well. So the chef is gonna take some water, pour it into the pot, and as he does so, the information is being sent to our little screen here, and right now I see that we have 200 grams of water that was just added to the pot. So what that means is that we no longer need to uh, add our ingredients separately or measure them separately. I can tell you, Chris, induction is one of my favorite ways to cook it. This surface is one of the smartest I have ever seen. Yeah. Come on, we still told that where the appliances are. Where the appliances are, all right. Well, they're coming right up, literally, so watch yourself. So this is a way for you to keep your kitchen counter nice and free from clutter. All of the appliances you're going to see, they're all wireless, they're all contactless appliances designed to work with the freestyle induction hub. Uh, let's jump right in. So the chef is going to grab our first uh, device. It's a tool that automatically stirs the food in your pot. Wow, awesome. Pretty fantastic, huh? It's All right. perfect for making the sauces, soups, soups, risottos, gravies, and It's perfect many, many for things. me because I could just walk away. Oh, That's wow. why. <laughs> uh, you go ahead and put that back. Um, all the way down at the end, we have a blender that uh, is great for smoothies. We've got a cool plate, which is great for uh, keeping cold food nice and chilled. And um, this is one of the more unique grills I think you'll come across. So. This grill begins with a, uh, a griddle that we place on the surface of the induction hub. 
and of course the hub recognizes that it's in place and that allows us to begin cooking with heat from below and that's good but if we'd like to add a little more heat we have an overhead unit which we add into the mix and the hub recognizes that it is in place we set our temperature and we are often running cooking with heat from both below and above this is perfect for cooking in smaller dishes. You can just pop them in here rather than cooking in the oven. Yeah, great for tapas or if you're cooking Absolutely. for one or whatever you need. So this whole idea of connectivity that we brought up earlier, how would you like to see that? I would love like to kitchen? see how you would make all my kitchen appliances more interconnected. Okay, so here's what that might look like. You remember that there's a camera inside of our fridge, right? Well, image recognition sensors will be able to recognize ingredients and also be able to let us know which ones might be getting close to their expiration dates. We want to be able to use them while we can. So we can select our ingredients, do a recipe search, and the system will automatically come up with suggestions for dinner tonight based on what we selected and our past recipe history. Look at this, I see it suggesting some of my favorite dishes, the Yaki Burger and Pumpkin Soup. So if we're good with the fun. soup and we're good with the burger and we're going to move forward, we have all the information we need in order to make that happen. We know what appliances we're going to use. We have uh, temperature settings. We have cooking times. What do you like to eat dinner? Seven o'clock. So if we're gonna sit down and eat at seven o'clock, everything will be scheduled in order to make that happen. Keeping in mind that some appliances are required to make more than one dish, right? So we don't want any overlap. The software will actually reschedule everything to make sure that doesn't happen. And when we're ready to begin, there is a progress bar which we can follow along with as we go. Wow, this is all the information you need to put a great meal right in your fingertips. It really is. So we've made a great meal. Have we forgotten anything? Bottle of wine. Uh, yeah, we need some wine. And so that is why there is a built-in wine cellar right at the base of the induction or the, the island right there. Wow. So that's what the kitchen of the future looks like. It's a beautifully designed space powered by uh, appliances that are wireless that you can place anywhere, filled with professional features, and powered by a level of connectivity that really makes cooking very interesting and very easy. Well, this is fantastic, but I still have one question for you. What's your one question? When can I get one? Ah, uh, when can we get one? So these are all future, forward-looking technologies, and we don't have a release date for any of them yet, but we're working on it, so. Thank you, Chris, I appreciate Thanks, it. Thanks, Chef, I appreciate your help all day today.